G'day guys, welcome back. Look at my dirty fingernails. Oh gosh, <clears throat> this is what happens when you're painting, isn't it? Now I'm still playing with these gel boom stains that Cass has sent me. And I'm gonna go with pinks and purples. Oh, and black. Black, 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 where's my black? There. So I might put a couple of layers of black in and I'm going to do a little ring pour. I'm going to try with three layers. This one's a pearlescent pink and can't read upside down. Gouldian Finch Mauve and then I'm going to chuck some black in and some of the darker pink, Lily Pilly. And pearlescent mauve. And then this is really dark purple. It's uh, violet. And then back to the pink. I like the little nozzles on them. You just have to push them open or closed. So that's pretty cool. And then the purple and I think I'll put the black actually I probably shouldn't have done that because the black and the purple are too dark I'll have to go with that one next and then the purple and we'll go back the way it was <laughs> and then um, oh what do I do now I'll have to go back with that one now I'm just all over the place aren't I Anyway, I'm just going to go for like three layers and see what happens. They're all over the place now, these colours. I think that's probably enough. I don't think I need too much. I'm not even sure how big that little container is. All right, so that's three layers. Now I've got my autofocus on my camera this time. So I'm hoping it's going to work okay let me just zoom in a little bit now that I've layered the colors zoom in a little bit maybe not quite that much how's that and hopefully it'll focus okay with auto focus okay I'll come around here so you can see what I'm doing and I'm going to just make little little rings. So I'm going to try and go from up high so that I can get smaller circles. Now, see what happens when you go from up high? It tends to go more of a um, a wiggle, whereas I want it more of a a circle. It's quite thick paint. Here we go. You do need a really thick paint for a ring pour. So these are perfect. Nice thickness. Purple seems quite dominant, doesn't it? I don't know where my pink's gone. I'll just go around a couple more times if I can get some more of that lighter color to come out. And then just put my finger on it there to stop it. And if it makes a little tail, you can just use your bamboo skewer just to go back into a little circle there in the middle. Why am I always off to the side? Hey. Oh, I don't know. I put my little thingy on, but it still went off to the side. All right, let me just center that a little bit better. And then I'll give it a spin, hey? Whoa! Where's all my pink gone? Oh, the pink's vanished. It's gone, skis. Purple certainly took over, but it's really pretty, shiny, shiny purple. I guess I had three purples and only two pinks, so maybe that's why. 
maybe that is why but look at the the um the colors there how they blend that's so pretty i love how paints do that see i can't get that with my glue and water mix i'm going to mix up some more and try and get some more pink coming through actually i might take out that that's quite um it's not very bright let's take that purple out and just try with the other colors hey Need another cup All right, here we go. Let's go again. Pink. And let's go pink and pink, eh? Okay? And then black. And then purple, purple. Just a little bit of black. We don't need a lot. And then purple. And purple. And then we'll go back to the pink. And the pink. And the black. more pink and more pink all right there we go let's see how these ones behave hey was that even in the oh yeah just okay let's go again i'll try and keep it over here more things that wants to go over there i wonder if i can pinch that try try and pinch it what happens if i turn this as I pull my little ribbons out. Oh, that's looking much nicer. It's all about the colours you choose too, you know. Making this little spout has worked better too. Been able to get it to come out in more of a fine stream but i'm still practicing with these i've only done a couple with the boom so still still practicing well, that's better i hardly left a tail at all okay well, that's looking really pretty let's just center it a little bit look at that dark purple in there hey I much prefer that to that other purple. I mean, it's a lovely colour, but just not mixed with the other colours. It just kind of took over a little bit. All right. Here we go. I'll spin gently. Oh, look at that. I actually don't mind that last, that little bit of the purple from the underneath there. Anyway, adds a little bit of extra dimension to it doesn't it and I love that I don't want to lose that dark purple there I don't want to lose any of it can I just leave it like that hmm I'd like to uh, yeah I don't want to take too much more off that's really pretty so pretty 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 um there's a little bubble pop 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 um, I'll just give it a quick little torch, see if anything wants to pop. These are really pretty colours. It's really quite 3D. It really is. When I was doing my rose, actually this would be really good for a rose, wouldn't it? Because when I was doing my rose, I was trying to get like this overlapping 3D look with the thick, these thick kind of fingerlings. So that's really, really pretty happy with this one this takes a little bit of getting used to a new product I think when you're trying it out all right let me take you down for close up and see what you think actually I'll just clean up the background and then put it on a clean background hey for you hang on that's better isn't it you can see without all that messy paint around it all right let's go down for a close up and we'll see how my autofocus manages without me having to touch the screen every five seconds as I'm moving around. Was it jumping around? I'll have to watch, go back and watch the, um, the video and see if the camera was jumping around trying to focus or not. So 
So where I pop that bubble, there's a little cell there. Oh, look at the shine. I can actually see the shine. I couldn't pick it up on my earlier video, but you can see the pearlescence there, sh shimmering. Pretty, isn't it? Shimmer, shimmer. Oh, look at that. It's shining. Yeah, you can see it there. But look at... Look at the way the colours have blended. But they've still stayed separate. The little tiny, thin, very dainty little lines of that pink, the hot pink. I can't remember what it's called. I can't look at the moment. <laughs> so pretty. And then over here we've got those thicker, thicker purpley ones. <clears throat> Oh, there we go. We can see that shimmer there too. It's like the pink. That's the pink that's doing that. That one, pearlescent pink. Oh, look at that. It's focusing. And then it's focusing again. Woohoo! So exciting. <laughs> All right, so there's that little shimmer there happening. And over there onto that. I kept a little bit of that original purple, as you can see. Just a little touch of it there. Don't mind that at all. So there we go. Really, really happy with that one. I think that's my favourite so far with the boom. So what do you think? Do you like that? Nice and easy to do. Don't have to worry about mixing paints. Um, I guess if you're doing a big canvas though, you know, you'd need a lot of paint. I, I don't know how much they are, I'm sorry, but maybe Cass, you can send me a link and I can put it up on my my video for people who want to purchase from you but if you're doing you know little ones and you just want to play around and practice and maybe not heavily into pouring then um, yeah these mixed paints are really really good to to start with because they're the right consistency so you don't have to worry about trying to find the correct consistency all right that's enough for me um, I'm going to clean up I'm done for the day and uh, I'll be back tomorrow. So everyone stay safe. Signing off from isolation in Queensland, Australia. I'll see you real soon for the next poll. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.